Come on over, it's welcome time for Tim Friend. Welcome back to Tim Friend. It's another very serious episode today. <laughs> uh, last time we talked about how YouTube's bots are causing me no end of slight distress. <laughs> Just the slightest distress. Just unrelentingly slight. <laughs> but it's because I put out an episode, it is every day. I, I yeah. would reiterate that at least. Uh, <laughs> it's important to me! Uh, but. In the grand scheme of things, it's very slight. It just adds to the the general stress of being alive at this time in our nation's history. Uh, <laughs> does mean, it? Yeah, it adds to the stress of being alive when I so clearly don't know about fish. How's that? But like, the bots commenting? Yeah, because yeah, I I look at it, I get excited, and then I feel sad. Like I get <laughs> I get sadder than the neutra neutrality I was at first. <laughs> <laughs> like, if I'm at zero, I'll go up by five and then down by seven. It just has to be, like, it fades into the background. Like, oh, another day, another bot. Well, shit, shit does fade into the background. Because that's, that's life. That's what happens. Sure. But when there's enough background noise, it's just called, it's loud. <laughs> you know? I guess. Oh. Yeah, I've talked about being stressed before on Tim Friend. We don't have to get into that. Yeah. <laughs> Though, when I was recording Darkest Dungeon a couple weeks ago, and yes. I was talking about how tense I was, yeah. and I remember you came out of the room and gave me a hug. Yeah. And said you hoped I felt better. And I was like, it's okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You don't gotta worry about I it. I did, um, because I, I mean, I just happened to not, I don't remember what I was doing. But I was in the room. I, I go to the the other room when Tim is uh, recording. So if it's weird. <laughs> I admit. <laughs> uh, no, I mean like, I don't know if anyone like thinks about the prospect of recording an episode, like a, a recording themselves, like doing shit, like giving mm -hmm. commentary and stuff and rambling, mm -hmm. like I. But like, imagines that someone is there to listen to it, like going about their like it. I'm. If I were just doing my own thing, or like, like it's distracting. Like it, it is distracting. You know. Because uh, and here's like, when I, because I make these and they have a fucking audience. Like that's. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's the reality of the situation. People view these on YouTube, so having a sort of uh, discomfort with uh, having someone listen to me just while I'm recording it mm -hmm. might seem a little weird. But it's like I'd be constantly sort of thinking about... Like, what you're saying and what how the other person, person is, is reacting to it. Exactly. Even if they're not reacting to it at all. And then, like, I, if I got up to go to the kitchen, mm -hmm. like, then you would see me moving, yep. and then that's a distraction. Just a slight distraction. And it's enough for you. It is. I'm very easily distracted. Very easily startled as well. Yes. Uh, I don't want to know how startled I could be. <laughs> like, on While a... While recording. Exactly. I imagine it's very much. Yep. <laughs> a very high level. Yep. Oh, you killed him. Yeah, we killed Nord. He was not very hard. Um, That's good. He had, uh, yeah, like... Lou. Oh, yeah. No, Lou... My boy. Lou's a fucking boss obliterator right now. He's mm. got super high speed. He does magic damage. He had way better stats than the boss did. Uh, but the boss had the Nosferatu tome. Oh yeah. Uh, which you are familiar with. Mm -hmm. uh, which the it, it's always very annoying uh, mm -hmm. to go up against. Like we talked through it, but like we had to fight like two extra rounds with Lou mm -hmm. because uh, Nord landed two Nosferatu hits. Oh. Yeah, and it's like fucking goddamn. Com <laughs> combined with the. Uh, the dodge chance of the dungeon right. or the the or gate. exactly it's Nosferatu bosses are super fucking annoying. Oh hey, here's Lal 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 Yeah, she's the dancer that we don't get quite yet, but we will soon. <gasps> she is a potential romance for Roy. <laughs> uh, hey please, wow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wow! So she like throws herself on him, right? And his response is, "Wow." <laughs> that is like, like how old is he? Like uh, he's, he's, he's like he's, maybe he's, 16, 17 now. I, I think he's because it's been two years. Oh, has it been? Doesn't wasn't there a time jump? Fuck! I don't. I thought it was months. Was it two years? Shit! Yeah. I've already forgotten. I mean, it could be awakening that I'm thinking about. To uh, be honest. Might be. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't 
played Awakening in so long and it's still in there. It, it is still in there, isn't it? You yeah. played it probably more than I did, honestly. I, yeah, I did. Um, <laughs> so for the gameplay, though. <laughs> well, for some aspects of the gameplay. Yeah. Uh, so for Lalum is a member of the Resistance forces on the Western Isles against the Etrurian tyranny. Gotcha. So she sort of fills Roy in on what's been going on. The Marquesses mm-hmm. and Warlords living here are taking people into the mine and work them until they die. Oh my god! They never let them rest, even if they're sick or injured. <gasps> Horrible. Wow. So we're fighting the Etrurian <laughs> government to protest against them. It's it's a more violent protest than most people think of when they think protest, but also, <laughs> fuck them. Yeah. <laughs> They're enslaving us. Yeah. Uh, then the, the one of the least pronounceable names is Mount Abrahu. Uh, <laughs> I can only oh assume my. that's how it's pronounced. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, so uh, we have to go to the mines before everyone's captured. Oh, my God. And then she throws herself <laughs> on it. Whoa! Whoa! This loud. Wow. Yeah, she bounces around all crazy. Uh... What? She gives you a sword? Oh, she gives you a, a worm slayer <laughs> sword. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. For some reason? Oh, uh, eventually... So, this is interesting. Okay. Uh, you... I don't think you will have encountered this in your experience playing Fire Emblem. Okay. I'm trying to remember through, like, Awakening and Fates, uh, and, Fates three. and Three Houses. But this is a game where you actually fight enemy manikeets. Oh. Yeah, you fight dragons. Well, I mean, I, I, I've encountered Worm Slayers because of Wyvern Knights and right. stuff. Right, and there's, like, in this game, I believe they're still good against Wyvern Knights, Wyvern Riders, whatever. Mm-hmm. But they also do good damage against dragons. Oh. Which is important, because the dragons are really fucking strong. <laughs> like, they, dragons are the reason why, like mages are super valuable in yeah. this game because yeah. they have massive defense and lower resistance all right so this map fucking destroys me <laughs> uh yeah tim and i were talking about this between before. episodes uh, uh i mentioned that this might be a map where we where i fuck up um mm. yeah and uh i'm not thrilled about it either uh in fact, like, I'm actually gonna look shit up. Uh, I'll probably stall this episode out, of, out a little bit uh, while we get set up. Yeah. So, uh, who, who are we gonna use? All right. I, I request Chlorine. Yes. Because she can talk to Klein. Yes. You have to. Thank God. I mean, obviously. Oh, she was I'll, I'll not, she's not up. a tradable person anyway. Well, that's she's true. She's mandatory. also just our only healer other than Ellen, but she's gotten benched. And All she's right. not full officially benched. I can bring in Ellen when I want. Gotcha. It's just she just got tradable. Right. Anyway. Roy, Chlorine. Roy, Chlorine. Mm-hmm. Uh, do I want to be nice? I, mean, I, I do. so prefer it. I kind of, like, because I have to think about this. Like, uh-huh. I told Tim yeah. that I have both Klein and Tate on my list. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If possible. Mm-hmm. I would like both of them. Right. Especially seeing how cute Tate is. Tate's pretty cute. Tate is adorable. It's hard to deny. So, Mm -hmm. I think because I want Tate, it means that I need to focus on maybe some better... (laughs) Some, I mean, some of my more high-leveled units, certainly. That's true. Um, Though, do you think that this is just going to injure like push back the you know like because i'm wendy's probably not at level no she's not but this is not going to be a good map for, for her, her anyway. anyway okay all right i think and i do actually let's check if there's an arena there's an arena shit we bring in wendy okay <laughs> um so does that like how does that work how does what work the, the arena the arena do you have to like arena grind after this map is done Oh, that's what you can do. You revisit the... I thought you had to do it now. I have to do it now. Oh. But this map's going to take a while. (laughs) Oh. (laughs) Yeah. Okay, well then, who are the people that we need to bring in because they need to arena grind? Uh, Wendy Uh, Wendy, is the most one. uh, She's the most one. Okay. Uh, Because, like, Fur fur is, like, almost caught up. Yeah, yeah. She's... Honestly, she's rocking it. (laughs) Bring Fur. All right. Because she's great. Uh... What do, you, what do you need? Um, what's on the map? Like, now I'm actually thinking about, like, so the, uh, thinking like a Fire Emblem player. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> axes. A lot of axes. Yeah. Um, it's going to be a lot all of right, axes. All right, all right, all right. Okay. 
I wasn't sure if they were gonna throw dragons at you. No, yet. no. They gave us the worm slayer for the map. Like, I don't know if it's after this. It might be the one after that. Gotcha. But... Okay. All right. So what? Uh, swords? swords are good against um, axes. You, <laughs> you like went back. To... Okay. All right. So um, uh, Ruck Rucker's good. Rucker's great. Yeah, Rucker's good. Um, if you scroll down. Um, uh, we got geese. I forgot about Fanny. 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 <laughs> uh, uh, geese. Throw geese in there. All right. Um, I did say better units. <laughs> I thought you said geese was geese, good. Geese is good. I will take this time to arena grind him a little bit. Okay. As well. All right. Um, Sue. Sue's dope. Sue's dope. Uh. You don't have to necessarily bring Lance. <laughs> That's polite. Thank I mean, you. it's up to you. Like, if you think he'll be it's useful. It's not up to me. I mean, it's Julia Mode. <laughs> fair, but if you think he would be useful. Uh, I think him. I think Lance would be useful because he can run quick. Uh, or Noah. Either. Bring in Noah. Yeah, Lance. Lance got in here last time, and he doesn't have any fun to support with. So let's bring Noah in for fur. Exactly. Uh, and then um. Oh shit! What? What do we? We got four more. Yep. Um. Not Chad. Okay, not Chad. Thank you, because I don't know. Um. Uh. What, UJ? You want to bring UJ? Uh. No, I was just mousing over. Oh, okay. Uh, Lou. Lou. Yes. Okay. Um. What's Lolina at? She could. Ten. She could use a little grind. Yeah. Prison grind. Yeah. Sure. Okay. And then. Uh, who else? Um, is that it? Like, as like far from, as, like... From these four? Um. <laughs> um. I think? What? From these four, I'd like UJ and okay. Lance. Well, and then, goes... what about Dorothy? Oh, Dorothy would work. Okay. Where's she at? There she is. I want to I wanna throw her in there. She's important. Like I had geese for UJ, Wendy, Lilina, Noah, Sue, Clarine, Rutger, Lou, Chad. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's basically. All right. Well, next time on Tim Friend, I will have done some research, figured Sorry. out where the reinforcements are coming was... from, because fuck this map. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to say that loud. Yep. F it. Uh, and I'll put everyone's items on there, and then we'll, we'll have a good time. Big old air quotes. <laughs> big, big one. Sorry. It's okay. That, it's not your fault. It's the game's fault. Yeah. Alright, bye everybody. Wah 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 w